Oh. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Factorio. I'm your host, Cifer Cat, and uh, we've got to fix some science. It's really no surprise. This is kind of what we're going to be doing for the next little while. So, we're working on asteroid mining, and that's cool. And space science is sort of not happening, but that's okay. It doesn't need to right now, because the actually it looks like it's sort of going. Yeah, neat. Uh, what we really need to do is get physics going, because no surprise, physics is le broken again. Why did I say le broken instead of just broken? I don't know. I wish I didn't as well. That's all right. I don't need to have respect for myself. I've decided just now. <laughs> Um, we have all the legs we needed. Oh, we probably do actually. Okay, anyway, what we need to have the problem of is that we don't have capacitors. Now, we don't have capacitors because I don't think we're getting our aluminium in here. Actually, there's another problem. That's right, I remember what the problem is. For some reason, this has never actually been connected to a wastewater out. So we do need to fix that. I don't honestly know how we have run this factory for so long and never had this wastewater out. It's probably just never been working, but it's never really been a problem. Which is kind of fascinating in its own kind of way. Um, you know what, sometimes you just need to be fascinated by how badly you can run things. I know it's something that I achieve every day of my life. Okay, so that's good. That'll do its thing. Now the next problem is aluminium ingots. They don't appear to be being made right now. And why is that? Because... Sulfuric acid. Interesting. Uh, we've got plenty of sulfuric acid in there. That train appears to be jammed for mysterious reasons, which I can go fix, I suppose. Mysterious reasons for a train never working is always never a good sign. Never a good sign, one might say. And that train has stopped for... Why is that train stopped? Hello, QB, how you doing? How's the uh, rock and stone going? Yeah, you know, it's always the big question, right? Um, I'll give you a shout out now, but I'll try to remember to give you a shout out later when we have a few more people around as well, because we're still at the start of the stream. But look, guys, if you're not watching QB, you should be. What's she been doing? She's been doing Pokemon. That's right, I watched a little bit of Pokemon. It was good. I was enjoying it. I didn't get to watch much of it, but I watched a bit, and I was like, yeah, Pokemon's happening. And that's, that's always a good place to be in, in life. If Pokemon's happening, that's good. <laughs> that being said, I've never beaten a... I love the idea of Pokemon. I just wish I enjoyed the games more. Oh, okay. Hopefully she's doing well. Um, do I have tanks with me? I do have tanks with me. Let's just put another tank in there just for jits and giggles, as they say. Probably put it in the right way. And we'll drop it down to about 10k. You know, honestly, it still didn't really help us as much as I wish it had. Oh, I guess it did. Okay. So that's going to go fill up that tank. That's good. Yeah, so hopefully sulfuric acid is just a thing that is going to be fixed very soon. Because we need it. Yes, we need it. I don't know how we're having sulfuric acid problems and how we still have them. As you'd think by now we'd have that all sorted out, but clearly not. I'm just going to put this tank here just so it can really just load up sulfuric acid. Because if it can make more, then that means we don't need to 
worry so much when the acid all sort of stops. It does, however, mean we're going to need a lot more volcanic gas, but quite frankly, I think we're already in that situation. Yeah, I think we're already in a volcanic gas problem. That's fine. It'll sort itself out, hopefully. Hello, Dave. How you doing? Your grandparents doing great? That's glad. I'm glad to hear that. Uh, Dave, I was thinking about you today. In not a strange way, I hope. Um, have you seen, like, the mobile game with, like, the ducks? <laughs> and you, like, just have a bunch of duck mutations? Have you seen this game? I just saw it and I immediately thought, if Dave's not playing this, he'd love this. I think it's called Cluster Duck. I could be wrong, though. Yeah, it's, it's a freemium game, so it's all paid by, like, ads, so, you know, enjoy that. But it's got ducks. And I thought, hey, this is Dave's game if I ever saw a Dave game. Cluster Duck is great. There you go. You got QB's seal of approval on that one. And like I always say, if you can get the approval of a fox, you're doing well in life. I've never said that, but perhaps I should start saying that. Alright, so that should hopefully deal with some aluminium issues that we've got. Now, the other issue we've got is we're just not really making enough uh, antennas. Now, we can improve that using the powers of science. And the powers of chucking beacons down recklessly. Which is usually, honestly, how I fix most of my problems these days. Um, he says as he awkwardly tries to do it and he can't quite figure out how. Such is my life. So I would imagine this would start to fill these up and then we'll be good, right? Right. That makes sense, anyway. So all I gotta figure out now is how to move these beacons in a way that is slightly more useful. You wanna play it with free and mobile games are not your thing? That's fair. That's fair. I respect that. I just saw ducks and I was like, this is... This is Dave's brand. But if it's not your thing, that's okay. I promise you I'm not a fiend in any way whatsoever. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Until we get the aluminium coming through... Which I... I've been assured by our top engineers it's happening any day now. Probably. I don't know if I can trust my top engineers, to be honest. Uh, just to be clear, our top engineers is just really me. Uh, and therein lies the problem. Our top engineers are not the best at what they do. Our top engineers are probably about a day away from getting fired, actually. Spend five bucks, get rid of it, and make all upgrades free forever? Well, there you go. You can also do that, I suppose. Uh, where, th where those, was the sulfuric acid going? Anyway, here. You know what? That seems like a similar problem. That once it gets here, it gets stuck. It's not the money, it's the time commitment. Oh, says the person who got me into another freaking idle game. Hmm, okay, okay, sure. Thanks, man. I see how it is. <laughs> ah, yes, I'll punish Thief, but not punish myself. No, I'm joking. I respect that. Those games are free and haven't... Idle game. 
Sadly, I didn't say that, but that would have been great if I did. Uh, idol I mean, what is that? Wasn't there that game that came out a few years ago that was like about managing idols or something? I don't know. I don't know what it was called. And it was like a JRPG. <laughs> I really can't remember what it was called. It's probably not relevant, though. Okay, so I'm hoping the sulfuric acid just keeps on coming out of here. Quite frankly, I need acid to just keep going out and filling up things because acid looks like we've uh, made some mistakes. We might possibly even... Uh, I was going to say need more trains to go pick up uh, volcanic gas, but they're all out, so I guess that's okay. Of course, when there's a lot of volcanic gas work, it does mean this is a huge uh, problem area. Everything jams here pretty nicely, which is not good. How far am I on swarms, uh, Swarm Sim? Uh, decently far. I think I've almost uh, respawned. Prestige like 10 times. Prestige is the wrong word. Reset. Um... I've been taking longer between resets now because I think I was resetting too quickly. I'm doing a little bit less of that now, but yeah, I'm still having fun, I suppose. You know, it's the sound of someone who is really not sure whether they're actually having fun or not. How many mutations do we have? I mean, I'm up to like one, like a few uh, quadrillion uh, things. I don't know what they're called. What are they called? Essences? I don't know. The stuff that you get. I don't know how many mutations I have. Some? Several? Four or, so, four or five? Mutagens, yeah. I, I've got like, a, I'm in the tens of quadrillions of mutagens. Um, but honestly, these trains look like they're going okay if it wasn't for... All those little jams we were having. It's alright, they get through. <laughs> this is happening again. The trains are trying to go... the wrong places. They shouldn't be doing that. You, you get to go out of town tomorrow to visit friends overnight? Awesome! Well, I hope that goes well for you. Hope you enjoy yourself. I think it's one of my volcanic stations that can't be right. That's wrong. It has to be. Um, that one be breaking it? Probably not. The you are trying to go there, but you shouldn't be. You should still be here. And you should be still here. You shouldn't be able to go. That's not how things work around here. <laughs> Maybe that one is sort of a fault. How the driving lessons? Uh, driving lessons are good. I have passed my test and now I'm just looking for a car. So yeah, driving is driving is done okay. Just need to actually get a car now, but that's okay. Like we, I can now drive, approximately. I'm not great at it, but I can drive. Practice will come. Practice will come in time. Okay, why are we always going over there? I don't like that. What is so important that we're spending all our acid over here? Right, sure, that's important. Actually licensed? I mean, yeah, I got my restricted, so it's it's something, you know? It ain't nothing, as they say. Oh, it's because it's trying to build up all the rutile at the moment. 
Uh, could we change these perhaps from okay going to do a real quick thing here which is going to be uh, blue ones to yellow twos yeah sure I don't think speed is what we have the problem with I'd rather have some more efficiency. Uh, but yeah, I got my license a couple of weeks ago. It was, um, it was close. <laughs> but I got there, and that's what matters. Okay, so that's going to empty that out. You love watching this game? What, Factorio? One day you'll play it? Don't ever play what I'm playing. Like, play base Factorio. Um, because base Factorio is not a freaking nightmare. This mode is just... is torment. That's why I play it on stream, because I want to hurt myself and I want others to acknowledge that I am a, I am a top tier gamer. Not really true, but... on any count, but... I am punishing myself, that's for sure. Uh, base game Factorio is really good and less stressful than what you're seeing here. Um, but even that, I like, the game scales up with you. Like, if you look at this and go, oh shit, I don't know what's happening. I will never be good at this game. You gotta remember, I built all of this, right? So I know what's happening. Absolutely terrifying for coming in and watching a stream and going, I give you what? Um, but that's not what normal people have as well, so I wouldn't worry about it. By normal people, I mean people who play this game. Are we normal? No, not really. Uh, you failed your first test for an improper turn. Uh, look, I failed my first test for uh, a guy speeding up when I was trying to turn into the lane. Because he didn't want me to go into his lane. Um, and I didn't notice him doing that. Uh, so basically I failed the test because some guy was an asshole. Uh, which, you know, hurts the human spirit a little bit. That's okay. Got through it. <laughs> Only slightly bitter that a guy in a four-wheel drive would do that. Um, no, I'm incredibly bitter, don't worry. Not even slightly bitter. One day you have the $50 to pay for it. Oh, goodness. Well... I hope that day comes, QB. Um, okay, but that should be presenting my aluminium just a little bit better. Just remember the graveyard is filled with drivers who are right. Oh yeah, no, exactly. I'm... My conclusion that when the assessor was saying, hey look, this is what happened. Like, you didn't notice he, he sped up so you couldn't part get in there. Um... It's not really your fault. And I said, yeah, but I should have noticed. And he's like, that's exactly right. You should have noticed. So that's what it comes down to. But that's okay. Like, I've got my, t I've got the thing. I didn't really get a lot of practice. So I'm pretty happy that I managed to get it regardless. And with more practice comes more proficiency. But it's always about safety. I want to make it home. I want everyone to be safe. That's That's my ultimate goal. Everyone be safe. I would go for the stream as well. Oh no. It just kind of broke. Damn. That sucks. <laughs> Bates don't usually do that, so I'm sorry that happened to you. Um, can we improve my capacitor production a little bit? So we are going to start getting the aluminium in here very soon, I think. Once the uh, trains get themselves sorted out with the sulfuric acid, which I think is happening now. Although we are running out of sulfuric acid, so maybe we're not actually do it, getting it done. We maybe go and drop the acid over here.
trains and the conveyor belts are really cool. Look, I love the conveyor belts. The trains take a little bit of getting used to. Um, I keep an eye on like the subreddit and 95% of them are people going like, hey, I think I messed up my trains. And then Soulburn, who hangs out here, is going, yeah, you did, and here's how you can, you know, and he helpfully directs him on how to fix it. But, you know, Soulburn, like, I see him on the subreddit. He's just being very helpful, and I just want to message him and be sarcastic. Just, he knows who I am now, so it's not going to work. You know, you can only trick Soulburn once. So you make sure the time that you trick Soulburn, you get him good. But the conveyor belts are cool. Um, as I said, base game is without mods and stuff is not as scary but you do it with a throwaway it is a throwaway that i got him it is with a throwaway that i got him um and then well i didn't even know it was a throwaway like i've got my main account which is on my computer and then i've got like just one that just was like eh just create on my phone um so that just sort of exists and i forgot that existed and yeah, just troll and soul burn just casually. Now, what's up with all this boric acid? That can't be good. What are we doing with this boric acid anyway? I don't think we're doing anything with it, to be honest. That's not how you spell boric, by the way. Um, not really much we can do with it, it just sort of exists there. Okay. Orc acid just exists there. The more you know. Um, I'm just gonna keep extending this problem. Keep extending the problem. Maybe the problem will go away on its own. It will not ever go away on its own. But that's okay. I just need to pretend not to care. Oh, what's over here? <laughs> the answer is nothing of relevance. Okay. The sulfuric acid should be demanded less now that we're not burning all this into sand. Never mind, I guess we did need more of it. It was tricked again. It's okay. I'm easily tricked, we all know this. Probably some validity to like getting more volcanic gas sites. Maybe. Some validity is always a good thing to have. Then again, like... Not like any train is ever just waiting for a chance to go get some gas. Oh, you mean if I actually say the words, no quote found? check as long as it doesn't happen twice mm, no look you are the keeper of the quotes and i don't want to make your life difficult because you're already doing me a huge uh favor and i appreciate it so no i would not do anything to try and make things difficult for you because you are already making things so much easier for me and i really appreciate it Okay, so this should be... It's making aluminium. Yes. Why is this aluminium harder to make? Oh, because we're doing fancier aluminium. Fancy! Okay, I didn't know we were doing fancy aluminium today. Uh, I had a thought. What if we had a train that took wires? That would be probably pretty good. Do we have trains? We have trains. Do we have batteries? We have batteries. Do we have rails? We don't have rails. Okay. Time to get rails. Uh, now, I do have rails. They're all on my box that I put somewhere else and I'll never go back for it. If I ever go back for it, it means admitting that I've made a mistake. And I refuse to do that. I am a perfect being that would never make a mistake. <sighs> <laughs> you 
You just got my message? Excellent. Well, that's fine. That's all right. Don't you worry about it. Sometimes I just like to send you little messages just to see how you're doing. <laughs> you know? Put on some bright red lips. It can be like all sultry. Like, Hi, Dave. How you doing? Just see how you react. Just for anyone else who's listening, I do not do that. And, uh, please disregard it who says that I do. <laughs> I most assuredly do not. For instance, I don't have red lipstick. And that's gonna be my alibi. Not a great alibi, Seif. It's what I got, though. It's all I have. Okay, more trains, yeah. So this train's goal is just to deal with things that I've messed up. Which I have indeed immediately messed up, so that's nice. Nice to know some things remain standard. Uh, so we have to go get some more things for this to work, but that's alright, we can do that shortly. And I'm red list. I'm trying to think if she does, I'm pretty sure she does. What, are you implying that I'm stealing my wife's lipstick without her knowledge? Absolutely not. You would not. Okay, um... Aluminium wire, or oh, cable, it's called wire, okay. So let's pick two. Okay, so, train. You go here, until you're full, and then you go... over here, until you're empty. You've got no power in you at the moment. Fix that. There we go. So right now nothing's going to happen because we never actually built these belts. When we build these belts, how boydy, how boydy, boy howdy, how boydy this is going to be good. <laughs> ah, don't. I'd tell her if I was stealing her lipstick. bad. <laughs> Too funny to pass up. Don't ever worry about my sake. I'm here trying to be entertaining to some degree. And you know it's going to entertain people, that one. We need to have that for future generations. Short generations, but it's still important. Okay, let's build that wire, and that'll fill up the train. Mostly. Oh yeah, exactly. You, you, you're taking me entirely out of context. How classic of you. Uh, what we'll do is we'll move that one for... Oh goodness, yeah, okay. We need to get more filters in here. Also, yes, the trains are signaled properly. Very rare thing that I get to say that aloud. Um, you know what? I could go get inserters, or I could get inserters to come to me. Why should you do work when the work can do you? <laughs> exactly. Uh, these are all going, it looks like. I don't even know what the context for that one is, but it sounds offensive. I don't understand, these are lesser people. Oof. Uh, looks like we might need some more water as well, actually. Where's my train? Is that it? There it is, it's coming. Nice. Uh, then we need to put some more water in this, because it's clearly not working. 
Where are we getting the regular water from? Can we just boost it? Uh, okay, what if we just say, for instance, uh, for example, just did something like this. That'll produce more water. Quite a bit more water, in fact. Actually, still not quite using enough, which is kind of crazy. Oh, wait, no, it was. That's fine. The important thing is that that should make these go faster. And sure enough, they are. To the detriment of wastewater. Yeah, I never... Please tell me I put, remember to put the inserters to wait for a second. Nope, they're just going back. Okay. I'll come back. I'll be back in a second. You'll be back after a moment. Do, 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 do. I don't know the song very well. I was just thinking of like uh, the King song in uh, Hamilton. I don't know the lyrics, so maybe I shouldn't be singing that one. But I did like the King's songs in Hamilton. They're my favorite songs. Which I'm sure is not the intent of that. I think as a, sh a play about American history, you're not supposed to be like saying, yay, King. But, you know. No good songs. They about talk about threatening innocence, and so that's always fun for a king. Okay, that should fix our problems here. Guy River Sweet Mead is pretty damn good. I don't even know what that is, but I'm glad you're enjoying it. That's emptying those wires out pretty quickly. That should help a few things. And that train has gone off. All mead is delicious. Is it now? I've never had mead, so I can't say. Okay, so that should send that train off to go make rocket fuel. Because for some reason we need aluminium wires to make rocket fuel. It probably makes sense to people, but not to me. Um, we'll see, finish the pack. What pack am I... What pack? What pack am I, what pack am I trying to do? Oh, the mod pack? God, no. <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking pack like pack of... I saw card and I saw pack and I just thought, pack of cards? How do you finish a tarot pack? <laughs> All right, so the card, I've done some shuffling. Well, I finished the pack today. There's more general advice about the pack today. Uh, we have... Judgment. Uh oh, I feel judgment's not good. Is judgment good? Major Arcana. I should know Major Arcana at least. Uh, the final stage before a new you is indication to look for a higher self. The go of the past and show in the world a new insightful version of yourself. Okay, well it's actually sort of saying, hey look, life can continue. Um, basically it says improve who you are. Is the conclusion I'm reaching out of that. And uh, you know what? I can improve who I am. I mean, in theory. In theory, I'm improving myself every day, right? Eh. <laughs> Arguable, that one. I'm trying to improve myself every day. That might work. Um, but yeah, look. You have faith. Oh, goodness. I hope faith is enough. I don't know if it is. But thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I still need to have, like a lot more things like physics and space science are going to just be the problems the problem children of the run and they'll get there they are 
progressing. Um, speeding up rocket science is good. I think the plan is once we have the space science done, we should be in a much better situation. In fact, it doesn't even seem to want to launch rockets right now. We might be able to finish copper today. That'd be exciting. Not quite the same, but... So I was thinking about my next run, which I'm very, very excited to do after this one. Obviously, that's how it works. Um, and I have been mulling over a problem for the last couple of weeks on how I'm going to resolve something. And I literally had a dream last night on how to fix the problem. And it is glorious, and it is, it is as glorious as it is terrible. And I was just like, yes, the dreams have come to me. I have been <laughs> witness to a dark elder god, and it has told me how to solve my problems. And I'm like, excellent. This is what I wanted. This is what I needed, in fact. So, you know, if an elder god comes to you in your dream and tells you how to solve your problems, that's where you want to be. Probably not actually, but, you know, that's where I'm at. So, but that's for the next run. But I think it's good. I'm really excited about what I've got to show you for the next run. Because I think you're all going to see it and you're all going to go, wow. That's, um, he's done something. And, uh, honestly, that is the highest praise I could get from anyone to tell me that I've done something. Okay, good news. I think that's going to fix my s physics science problems. Oddly enough, also my purple science problems, which I didn't even know I had. Hmm. We'll fix problems, and uh, fixing problems, that's what we do here. Sometimes. Sometimes we create brand new problems, but that's, that's neither here nor there. Right now, all we're doing is just waiting for the aluminium to come into here, and then I think we're going to get see some real shit happening. Is there any validity to putting more yields in here? Eh, probably. You know what? Yes, there is validity to putting yields in there. I love that the train's stop so quickly it really did just look like that one was about to collide into the back of it and it's like nope cooler than that cool trains okay well the, the spaceships are leaving again that's exciting uh how many copper drones do we need so we need to launch 20 we're at 55 percent so we need nine we've got one okay so if we can get eight more of these we can stop launching satellites uh sorry miners would be good i'd appreciate to stop dropping miners okay yield modules please sir i wish to has that face is the face of a man who just said i wish to has and thought that was Good speaking. Hello, sir. I wish to has. Yes, indeed. That's how we speak. Yes. We're intellectuals, we are. My vocabulation is very high. I see. That sounds like it's just talking shit. Ah. Change that. Uh, can we move those a little bit closer? Oh, those weren't there for that reason. Those were there to speed up actual science. Interesting. But either way, I think that's still going to be progression.
Um, do we have another packer? We do have another packer. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to... Yeah, it looks pretty full. Is it full because it's full or full because we're lazy? How about a belt? It's full because we're lazy. Of course it is. I don't even know why I ask some days. Okay, but the point is these are being made faster and it's making one of, oh, two of these each time. Okay, that's fine. That means these are being built. That means everything's just sort of flowing along just a little bit better. And that's what we want. That's what we want to see. I am seeing more of these, though. This is what we need. <laughs> Hello, Tower. You kind of scared me there. Good job. Much applause. Good morning. How you doing? Okay, so this is going to help make the physics science. Um make it any faster that'd be probably pretty good it is going at a good speed though it'd be great if this train system was less terrible but this remember is uh, a tourist attraction with the flashing lights how amazing is that it's like Las Vegas except it won't take your money but if you stand in front of the trains it will take your life also like Las Vegas I suppose I really don't know how Las Vegas works. Does Las Vegas threaten you? Like, I, I don't know. I've never been. Maybe Las Vegas threatens you on a daily basis. I don't really know. That seems like a fun uh, search though. Is Las Vegas dangerous, AKA will it steal your m wallet? The answer is it probably will actually. Now that I think about it. Yeah, but everything is flowing now, which is what we kind of wanted. It will, but you give it up willingly. Mm. Probably true too. And again, Gambling addiction can be rough. Not always as willing as you'd think it would be. Interesting. Batteries don't take capacitors? That's actually kind of fascinating. I assumed they would have. But I guess I was wrong. Okay, but are we making science again? This is actually the big key thing that we need to confirm. <laughs> we still need more antennas. That's currently a problem. Uh, and also more beacons, because beacons is the lazy man's excuse for efficiency. I have efficiency when you can just have more beacons. Exactly. Ooh, I don't like that. We appear to be belt threading on purpose. That's dangerous as hell. Well, that'll speed it up a little bit, at least. If those uh, antennas ever come through, which they really don't appear to be, do they? Oh, there's one. They're coming through. They're just taking their sweet time. Right, but they're backing up in places, and when they back up, then we'll be okay. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, th these are coming out pretty quickly. Not ideally quickly, but they're coming out. So you better get this party started.
But yeah, as they start to back up, then we'll be making more stuff, and it'll be great. We'll love it. Everyone will be happy. There'll be smiles all around. Just big smiles. Yes, that seems like I'm not losing my shit at all. Um, what is going on here? Right, you're trying to build those. And that's taking time because you're slow. What I kind of want to do then... This. I actually do really need these to be built sooner rather than later. Of course, the other alternative is I could just go grab a bunch of antennas and just chuck them in. How many of these radars do we need per science lab? Uh, one? One is acceptable. One is acceptable. And it will, it'll finish what it's doing here soon. So long as these don't go anywhere else, which I don't think they do. They do. Never mind, I was wrong. Ah, but they go somewhere where it's also needed for physics, so that's okay. Point is, we probably might even have some science happening right now. We don't. Wow, that was so great that I spent a large section of time the other day uh, doing a whole bunch of stuff that didn't really matter on hindsight. Because until we get this sorted out, uh, it's really kind of pointless a very bad pencil. Two though. The one should go the correct way and build that. In fact it's going to build two of them. How exciting. One's going to go that way which is needed for sciences or space sciences and one's going to go this way which is needed for physics. In fact we do have physics going. Go physics! Go physics! Go physics! Go! 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 Okay. No one should ever be that excited about physics, aside from maybe, like, a high school teacher that everyone thinks is weird. <laughs> you know the one? Hey, kids, I'm cool and awesome, and you know what else is cool and awesome? Physics. He does the finger guns, and everyone just groans. Anyway. Unrelated, we once gave a cool physics teacher uh, a mental break breakdown in high school, so not proud of that as a class. Um, but he'd definitely be the one that that would happen to. He wasn't that cool. He wasn't as distressingly not cool as I was just being there, but he certainly wasn't cool. He tried. He tried to be hip and down with the kids, and that was his downfall. Never try to be hip and or down with the kids. sure did uh maybe like some more antennas would help is this really needed probably not but we're gonna do it anyway okay so that's the rubber and we need this which we can also get fairly easily. And then we also need red wires, which oddly enough come from Yeah. We could actually move that out one and it would work probably. This is absolutely a band-aid fix, which uh, honestly, uh, honestly is probably what I do best, is band-aid fixes. Not a real fix, but it'll do the job. Okay. That's looking good. 
That should give us more antennas, and thus hopefully m just more production. Do I feel good about this? No, but it'll work. I guess. Okay, I shouldn't be standing near this train track. This train track is very scary and dangerous, and that is how I will die. Which is, you know, convenient in a sense to know how you're going to die. You know, we can't all be told by, like, an old babushka lady on the side of a street. <laughs> you know, the normal way people usually find out. Who cackles wildly. As she shows you, like, a picture of you being hit by a horse and cart. And you're like, lady, there are no horse and carts out here. And you walk out the door and immediately horse and cart gets you. That's how it works. I don't make the rules, I just follow them. Okay, we've got physics going a little bit faster now. And that should improve everything. And when these uh, radars have become less required, then it should actually fix everything better. Yeah. It's just crumbs. Cause there's crumbs in there's crumbs in the chocolate packet and I've been enjoying the crumbs when you're not looking. Oh, there's nothing there now? You probably should. I was keeping it because there was crumbs, but I guess if there's not crumbs. I'm in trouble guys. I left an empty pack in the fridge. I thought there was crumbs, you can throw it away. I another chocolate would be wonderful. Thank you. As she t walks out of the room, she she walks, and then she just does a, like, just a really quick head turn. I'm like, oh gosh, I am in trouble. Not actually. She's just confused of why I am how I am, which, to be fair, if you're not wondering that, welcome to the stream. Uh, you're new here, clearly. I'm also not sure why I am this way. I can't really give you a good answer. I always like to say to people I'm a broken individual, which immediately makes you go, I'll oh, see if you're not that bad. And I'm like, <laughs> validation. <laughs> sure, please. You know, I, I force them to be like, I'll oh, see if you're not that bad a person. You're not, you're not a broken individual. They go, oh, I am. And they go, no, you're better than that. I'm like, nah. Those are typically people who don't watch the stream though. So, you know, they've clearly got higher hopes for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, how are we going here? It looks like things are going pretty well. Physics is happening. We can probably go drop off a load of physics. It looks like a load of physics is already being dropped off. Oh, damn. Drop a whole load of physics. Mm-mm. Where'd it go? Thank you. What's this? Whitaker's peppermint. Oh. You want to see my reaction? It needs to be a little bit less cold. It's very subtle pe peppermint. On the out of on the mint scale, the only scale that matters with mint chocolate. Maybe a one. It's a hint of mint. It's hinty minty. <laughs> you enjoyed that? I would not say it's mintaz, bro. Because it's not mintaz. It's. Yeah. Yeah, nah. I know. It, it's good chocolate, but it's just. It's just but what I want is mint chocolate that just blows my socks off. Like I, I, I right now, I'll show you this panda before I get in some weird areas. I still got socks on. Did not blow my socks off. <laughs> I was going, I'm not showing my feet on camera. That's getting into a weird territory. Nobody wants that. No, I'm not. I'm not, I, I'm not doing it. What if I find out I have cute feet? I don't want that. I don't need that knowledge in my life. <laughs> No one needs that knowledge in their life.
you know, unless you're trying to make money out of it, I guess. In which case, I guess you do need that knowledge. Uh, the big conversations we have with Panda over here. The best thing is that conversation is not like scripted or anything. That's just the conversations we have. Okay. Science is being made. That's very good. I wish we were making more science. Um, but at this stage, figures can't be choosers. Mm, actually, maybe beggars can be choosers. It does look like it's doing okay. Like it's mostly not stopping. I was about to say it's not stopping and then it stopped immediately. If that starts to back up, I mean, maybe we put another lab in, maybe build more labs. It'd be a dangerous uh, precedent to set. Get down, Mr. Precedent. Sorry, every time I hear the word president, I just think that's, that word sounds a lot like president. And then I giggle to myself in the way that I often do, usually while working, and my co workers want to have me committed. We're not wrong either, that's probably a fair thing to do. Okay, but here's the important thing we currently have 342 physics science. Quite frankly, I don't need to continue working on my Android construction until we've got the science absolutely down pat. Okay, here's a thought. What if we added more yield modules? Like we've got these fancy, fancy, fancy schmancy yield modules that we sometimes use. What if we made more of them? I don't think we need them for anything else. So why don't we make more fancy schmancy yield modules? Why not? I mean, why else would you have fancy schmancy yield modules if you aren't going to use them, right? They, they're so fancy. I like how there's just the occasional uh, train station that's still got a default name. I don't know why or what the... Like, there's clearly a Dune reference over on the side there, and I'm like, I don't know Dune well enough to know if this is a good thing. This is a bad reference? I don't know, it could be. Uh, speed, 50%. I don't really care about energy consumption. If energy consumption's a problem, we can just make more energy, right? Um, I would probably like to go and get a few more blue circuits. Originally I didn't think I needed so many blue circuits, but now it turns out I guess I did. If it's psychotic to be happy, then I guess I am. <laughs> uh. Oh, we may have built too many of those. Where are you going? What are you doing? Are you filling that train with fuel? Okay. Hurry on, I guess. Uh, we can probably turn that off. Uh, yeah, sure, based on that, you absolutely could. However, whether that actually works or not, uh, I'll tell you now, it doesn't. Well, no. <laughs> Again, if my ethics is so low, isn't it? Don't be mean to people. Don't blame anyone, unless you give me a, a dollar. Then, in which case, you can you can blame people. It's cool. Uh, I forget how bad my ethics are some days. They are truly atrocious. Speaking of which, I've been informed I should probably stop talking about slaves so much in uh, Rim World. So from here forth, they're going to be known as prisoners with jobs. Um. <laughs> It's not better. <laughs> but at least it's a Thor Ragnarok reference, and people love Thor Ragnarok. I know I do. I 
I guess I probably need to have another word for eating people as well. <laughs> Rimworld got really dark. If you're not if you're not watching that, I apologize for what you've just heard. You didn't come into this stream for such debauchery. You came in here for engineering. Which, you know, that, that's on you. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so we got some uh, level 4 yield modules. Which will improve efficient productivity a little bit. And then what we'll do is put these really good speed modules in. So right now, crafting speed is somewhat slow, but oh, what are we doing? Beating it up. We have run out of things entirely. What's happened? How have we run out of center nodes? I thought everything was fine. What happened? No, I go away for one minute and this is how you pay me? I thought you could be trusted, Factory. Why can you not be trusted? Not enough antennas. <sighs> so mad right now. What ran out? Red wires. What? I guess we're needing a lot more of these than we used to? For some reason? Well, can we speed that up? Maybe that'll help. Fascinating. Something else has happened in the production chain somewhere that is causing a back... Maybe it's these. No? I don't know. Regardless looks like we just don't have enough of these being made. Can we increase the yield? It's really my answer to everything. Increase the yield, increase production. Increase the yield, increase production. What will we do, Steve? Have you tried increasing the yield and increasing production? My god, he's done it again. Eh. How will we ever survive this? You know, our people are going to go hungry. Try increasing the yield and increasing speed. My God, he's a visionary. Look, I'm just an everyday person, okay? I'm not a hero. <laughs> Uh, okay, we're gonna need more large beacons very, very soon. By that I mean, like, right now. But also... We have things that go from yield to... Oh, so production to yield? We do. It's gonna slow it down a bit until we go get our large beacons, which we're gonna run off and get them now. Ah, so much work to just get this last little bit done. I mean, two sciences, that's all we need. Well, technically three. But let's not worry about the, the second one that we need. The third one is... The third one actually might be easier. Because it needs... This one needs 120,000 space science. Speaking of space science, are we launching anything at the moment? No. Apparently not. We do have three coppers ready to go, though. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Three out of nine. Making progress. What's that accent? I do not know. Alright. Let's run back there, see what we can do to fix things up. Go, Spider-Tron! You know what? I just had a thought. Spinatron's cool. But we've got legs that we're not using. 
What if we made Spiletron faster? No reason not to. I mean, it'll burn through power a little bit faster. That's probably a reason not to, but uh, I don't care. And that's where you truly win. When you don't care, that's when you win. Put this here. And here. Oh, damn. Look at that. We got production, boys. Sometimes I accidentally get cool. I should stop doing that. Jokes, I never get cool. <laughs> okay, and then what I think we do is we do one more of these. Yeah, one more is a pathetic number. One is the most pathetic of numbers. Especially when you're one off, like what I just did there. Boing. Okay. We're going to check those sciences in here just so that way we don't have to worry about them ever again. Um, and hopefully, in the time we've been working, we've got so many physics packs. 350, that's not enough. It's not near enough, in fact. That looks like those are going. Those look like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't quite catch that. Those look like. Yeah, yeah. yeah, pretty much. Where else are capacitors going? They're going that way, but they're going to be blocked off very soon. Okay, and then they also go down here. Which they'll get blocked off eventually too. But if I was to say, hypothetically speaking, of course, just sort of go like this. Oh, what a save kicked in. Scatter, scatter. Okay, speed up the capacitor production. I think they'll like it. I generally want to try and make my factory happy. Generally. So these are going crafting speed 2.8. You know what? We can go faster. 3.4 and 4. Yeah, that's good. As fast capacitor is probably going to be an issue very soon. We don't have them. Uh, we only need one capacitor per antenna, actually, so... Probably fine. And looking closely, the antenna run is looking good. Okay, so those will all eventually back up. Probably not eventually, probably quite quickly, in fact. So we've just recently dealt with a shortage. And sure enough, we are getting more sciences in again. But it's not quite where it was a second, uh, like a few minutes ago, where it was just like going fast. You know what, let's not even worry about the androids until we do this, finish the science, but it's quite frankly, what's the point? Uh, we're currently going at 2.2, we can go faster than that, we can go to 3. I said faster than that, I kind of mean even faster than that, but that's okay. 3 is faster than 2.2. That is not an incorrect statement. What if we went even faster to five? 
What if? I mean, is it too fast? I don't care. I live recklessly and on the road. I'll do what I need to do. I don't live on the road. <laughs> what am I talking about? I live recklessly, though. That is that is still a, still a true statement. And all physics sciences are currently going. Yes. Hey kids, physics is fun. How many physics do we have just sitting here at the moment? Uh, 560. So, 560 times 5, that's around 2,700 or so. That's only about 1,000 points of research. You'd think it'd be more, but for some reason this one's doubled. Which is kind of painful, but we'll get there. The important thing is that it just keeps being made. Meanwhile, meanwhile, somewhere in an undisclosed location, uh, being made. We are still at three coppers, which is good, but I would love it if we had nine coppers. That's really my takeaway conclusion of this. Well, then again, can, when we finish with this one, we can actually turn guide drones back into asteroid miners and hopefully do it that way. Maybe we don't need to worry about it. Maybe we need to stop making guide drones for the moment. You know what? I agree. I agree with myself. <laughs> it's always a good position to be in. You never want to disagree with yourself. Those fights get nasty. No matter who wins, you punch yourself in the face. And that's not a win for most people. Most people would consider that a loss. And other people would be at a loss for words of why you're just standing in the street punching yourself in the face. Now, I left this alone. Hopefully it doesn't stop. All sciences are proceeding. Good, good. What we might do, should this continue, is maybe even, if we feel in a bit saucy, a bit spicy, do another one. Do we feel saucy and or spicy? That's the real question. The answer is, sometimes. Because, quite frankly, oh, we've got another one, actually. I really just want to get space science high. I mean, who doesn't want to be high on space science, am I right? Although, that being said, we actually do need more space science right now, so... Off you go, buddy. Oh, did we just get, uh, labs in? We must have just got labs in, because it seems to be fine now. Uh, lab, 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 lab. Labs are not needed to make rockets. Labs aren't needed to make rockets. They need to make satellites. Silly me. I knew that. Okay. Making 10 reactors is going to be a little bit of a pain, but we'll get through it pretty quickly, actually. No, that's going to be easy as heck. Sulfuric acid's still a little bit slower than I would like it to be, but I think it's okay. I mean, the trains are delivering the uh, uh, spicy gas quite regularly, which is important. I have been informed that I am the spicy gas by my wife. Thank you, thank you. 
Uh, 12.8. 14.96, okay. I mean, I believe the next thing we'll find out is what else isn't being constructed fast enough. That's typically what happens when you speed up everything like this. You find a new bottleneck that you were previously unaware of. Put this one around. Yeah. We will. Uh... Oh wait, do we actually have? We actually have those in service. That's really crazy. And then we do another one going out. Okay. We've increased production yet again. Nice. That's good news. I love seeing an increase of production. So that's going to drop off the space science. I don't know how long that's going to last. Probably not very long. I, f I think the space science will last longer than the physics will, honestly. But I think with the changes we've made recently, I think space science is going to be doing a better job now than ever before. At least until one of these machines craps out. As stated, I don't know which one's going to crap out, and I'm very excited to find out, but one of them will. I can tell you that with utmost certainty. Um, and it appears it's radars again. Really? The antennas have crapped out again. How? How? What is wrong with you? You ran out of capacitors. Ow. Alumnia. Oh, yeah, okay. Wait. Ah. Uh, we built it backwards. Okay. That was a me fault. That was a me mistake. That wasn't the game. That was when I put this and I put it out in backwards. Okay. I, I'm fine with that mistake. It's an easy mistake to make. It wasn't based on production problems, it was just based on me just being silly. Which does happen from time to time. Sometimes your old pal C for Cat does something silly. And that's what happened here. Anyway, we should be... We just dropped off a bunch of labs, so we should be making a lot of uh, satellites right now. Which will be highly exciting. And that should also launch a lot more rockets, which gives us a lot more science, which sort of progresses us in the correct direction. Now we kind of, I don't want to have to monitor them too much, but I think I will have to a little bit. There's still a lot of launches that are required, unfortunately. Um, I don't know if we've got any physics over here that just never got used. Oh my goodness, we do. Oh my goodness, we do. Oh my goodness. We do. That's a lot of physics we've just left behind for a long period of time. Be a little bit unhappy about that. <laughs> I clearly have done this run before.
Okay. Uh, where did we have... Uh, yeah, this one. Able train limit zero. I never want trains to come through here. Okay. Let's pick up all this physics. Oh my goodness, this is so much physics. Wouldn't it be faster to just pick it up from the box first? Oh my goodness, it actually might be. Oh my word. Oh my god. That's a lot of physics. It's leaving a lot of physics on the table there. You never want to leave physics on the table. Who knows what it's going to do to the table. It's going to ruin your resale value of the table. Goodness gracious. So embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed of how much physics is just sitting here. How much physics is this? Uh, it is 2.4 thousand boxes, each box holding five physics. So, I don't need to do a calculator for that. 10,000 physics? <sighs> still not nearly as much as I need, but still. I was hoping it was going to be a higher percentage than that. Right. 10,000 physics is still nothing to sniff at. If I have anyone sniffing at my physics, one, stop, two, gross, three, stop. Sniffing at my physics, it's gross. <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. All right. Physics, yes. Okay. Well, there's lots of physics now, which is nice. And there's more coming. So the bottleneck is, again, Destination full. Oh, yeah, I suppose you might be. You can get back there. You're holding a thousand physics on you right now. Wow. Physics might be okay for a little while. As long as these rockets keep launching, I think we'll be okay for a little bit. Keep those rockets launching, keep those satellites going. Um, oh, while we're waiting, we might as well, let, let's launch those coppers. Might as well, right? Also, Panda, you are forgiven. You're welcome. So, when the if we can get the space lines to go a little bit faster, which I think we can actually, we've got more haste modules, like these haste module fours. So I mean, you'd be a fool not to make them go a little bit faster, right? It's like 35 megawatts each. Oh my goodness gracious. Um, 
Oh, that one's already going as fast as it can. Okay, well, that's cool, I suppose. Eat up what you can, just keep going with the rest. Okay, so that's launching a lot of science, or making a lot of science rather, which is ideal for what we wish have, have, have happened. As long as the satellites keep coming through, I'm happy. Uh, I think you can go drop that off. You might as well. No, that's not why we were here, though. We were here to pick up this copper. Actually, no, why are we here to pick up this copper? This is your job. You go pick up the copper. You're in the train. Strip him! <laughs> uh, that is a... Uh, Rimworld line if I ever had to guess. It does sound like the sort of thing I would shout while playing Rimworld. harm and getting like some more of those things done up. How are we doing with labs? Probably a short. Probably why we're having... Oh, actually exactly a reason why we're not building stuff as fast as I wish I was. Okay. Hello. Would you like some copper? We've got four delicious drones of copper for you. You want to know where to put them? Alright, I'll tell you where to put them. You're going to put them here, 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 and here. You can put it right on that biter. Just scare the shit out of him. Five percent, sixty percent. Man, how much are those probes going to count for each? Uh, oh, that's right, that train can't reverse. I forgot. I guess I'm gonna have to drive this manually. That's okay, I know how to drive, so it's fine now. Okay, so we only need five more uh, copper drones, which I'm not gonna worry about now. We can worry about that when we're nearing the end. It's probably more important to just get science happening. And speaking of science happening, is it? Yes, yes it is. It'd be cleaner though. You see a spiral happening here, which is interesting. A spiral to me implies that we've probably put Hmm. No, that's probably fine. The important thing is that it is just sciencing. No, you know what? There's no reason to ever not deliver here. Just deliver here if you can. This is just kind of fun, just watching so many rockets just launching.
That's what you want to see. Now the next question I've got is, are we beginning to stack up on science labs? The answer is probably no. In fact, we're not even making science labs again. Right. Oh, for a very different reason though. Something else is short now. We knew this day would come. That we've done so well on the radars that something else would crap out. So let's go figure out what it is. Science labs are imperative to continuing this because they are needed for both satellites and physics. Which is, uh, things we need to finish this mod. Let's see if we can figure it out. Valdek wants to see a cat from the calendar. Alright, we can do that. Oh! Oh, it's fluff. I warn you, it's a fluff cat. problem all beacons okay let's look at this fluff cat there's a bunch of stuff on this desk right now don't mind that okay let us set up the poll very important poll as we all know poll is is it a great cat yes all cats are good cats this is a great cat now as always, if it's a great cat, you say yes. If it's not, you say no. Um, and if it's a great cat, it'll go into Cat of the Month for March. Keep in mind, Cat of the Month is happening in... Because it wasn't ready yet. Goodness. Um, cat of the Month for February is happening on Monday uh, Factorio stream. So the next Factorio stream I'll do, I uh, will have the February uh, the Cat of the Month for February. Uh, there will be a lot of cats to look at. I think people have been very uh, thinking every cat is a great cat, so it's going to take a little while. It'll probably take us about an hour like it did last time. There will be a lot of votes. Um, but it's going to be a good one. I think February is a good month for cats. And uh, yeah, so look forward to that stream because it's going to be a big one. Uh, I think what I'll do is I'll do Factorio. I'll end the Factorio an hour and a half earlier than I normally do, so it gives us plenty of time for cat of the month. All right. So anyway, we'll talk about that later. Now, let's look at that cat. Now, let's say it's a good cat. You know what? It's a great cat. Absolutely. I'm a big fan of a fluff cat. Uh, and... Ah. A few results, please. Uh, okay, that's three votes saying yes. And one vote saying no. So that is deemed a great cat. Excellent. Factorio back up, put the cat in, on the box, because actually those are February cats. I don't want to put the cat in the box because it might fight with the other ones. You don't want to do that. You don't want to have intermonth uh, fighting going on between cats. Uh, interesting. We are having problems with electric engines. These ones. That's concerning. Proper cat puts itself in a box. Yes, but you see it's a picture of a cat, Feldak. It's not actually a real cat. It was a real cat, but then they took a picture of it, and now it's not. You are correct, though. A proper cat would put itself in a box. I like how we've just got the solar panel just chilling here. Uh, so where does this beacon live? I do not know. Might have to reverse it. But we do know. We've seen them before. They're over here. They're here. Why do we not have beacons? Not enough memory circuits. Interestingly concerning. Concerningly interesting. Why do we not have enough memory circuits? Because they're lazy. Can't help but notice these. Uh, there's a bunch of problems going on right here. What I'm witnessing. 
For instance, these are small simpler twos and not threes. These are consuming the circuits. But they will get there in time. I love being a boxer. What cats do? Uh, okay. I love this. This design is terrible. I wanted it on the far side, so I put them on the side there. That's that's such a cursed design. Uh, I succeed, I suppose. I succeed. All right. Uh, let's go and get some small assembler threes. Just a stack of them. We really need. Hey guys, it's a car. Look at that. Remember cars? We used them before we had the spider. Remember how often I used to lose the car? It was the worst. Oh, and there's also a truck. It looks a lot like a tank, but do not be fooled by its trucky exterior. Or tanky exterior, it is clearly a truck. Why are we not making these? Ran out of iron oxide, interesting. I don't really care, but it's interesting nonetheless. Uh, let's put that in there. Beat those up. Okay, that should fix a lot of our problems. But I think we've got other problems as well to do with the steel that I see. I'm pretty sure I still problems with steel plates. Yeah, two steel plates is not near enough steel plates. What's happening with gravel? Uh, gravel? Hello? Did we just decide we didn't want to work anymore? Is that the plan? Nobody wants to work anymore. Oh, shoot. I know what I've done wrong. I have been unloading the sulfuric acid. The sulfuric acid was needed to run this part. Oops. mistake it's one of those things you just come along something you go oh that's weird and you just turn it off and you never really remember why you did it um, and that's clearly what's happened here it will fix itself in time no, it won't uh, what we're gonna do is let's So, uh, if it does fix itself, we will start dropping it off again, but if it doesn't, then it'll be okay. I suppose we've got crushers on us, do we? Uh, we've got crusher twos, aka not what we want. Alright then. I'm suspicious of this, but I think it's okay. Uh, now, hopefully that'll start getting rid of all this gravel that we have just lying around. Oh god, there's so much gravel. 
That's why it all jammed up. Okay, but it'll start fixing itself. In fact, let's make it fix itself just a little bit faster. Every little bit will help here. Wow, that really jammed up a whole bunch of stuff messing that up. I feel like this part was already kind of struggling and I just made it worse. Let's see for cat story. gonna start burning through that. Problem is the gravel, it's not actually even the mineral dust. The sheer amount of gravel that we need to crush into dust that's gonna take time. Um worth upgrading these crushes, yes it is. Where are the crushes? Where is this? Go there, okay. I was going to make the train come to me, but it's probably faster and more useful to go to the train. Because if we can speed up these crushes, then we should hopefully stop some of the problems that we've got in the factory with all this bloody gravel. Classic thief mistake here. Classic thief mistake. Wah, 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 wah. Did I just air one myself. Absolutely freaking lootly. Will I do it again? Absolutely freaking lootly. Is that kind of weird? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, absolutely freaking lootly. <laughs> yeah. Uh, where was it? up here somewhere, wasn't it? Yes. That's right, mining's at 34%. Well, actually, it looks like it's progressing. It looks like it's doing slightly better than it was before. That's honestly what we want. 3.8 goes to 7.6, yes. Okay, that gravel's moving on, that's what we want to see. This gravel is catching up as well, although, you know, that problem isn't the gravel, that's the problem with the uh, steel. Steel is fine. The only problem with steel is okay. situation should be resolved. I've got some grables for you. No, we're not doing a guy from Adventure Time. We're not we don't have any grables. No grables. Good news, gravel has been uh, solved. And now it'll get, have some time to deal with the mineral dust, but that's okay. It'll deal with that in its own time. Huh. 
That's right, these pipes don't work, the, these tanks don't work the way you think they do because they have pressure. Or they need different amounts of pressure to work. I forget about that. That's one thing I'm not going to miss from the early game, or this whole mod, that tanks have pressures that you got to consider. Uh, we appear to be out of satellites. That is a damn shame. And it's just going to slow down the whole process. But we've got 1.2 mil uh, million, I wish. 1.2 thousand space science, so that should help. How's physics going in the meantime? Because I can't ever trust physics. Sure, physics says it's doing fine. But is it actually? Yes. Oh. Good. I mean, they're all producing, so that's really what you need to see. Maybe that's okay. I'm gonna burn through physics really quickly right now, though. That's the problem. Not really a problem, it's just what it is. Uh, and we have a bit of a problem here with lime that we're not burning through that fast enough. We can probably speed that up, right? Is that slowing down the steel production as well? Getting through enough lime. Uh, excuse me? Speed is 30, that speed's also 30. Okay, that's fine. How are we doing for the power? I know it shouldn't really be a concern, but yeah, 6.2 out of 6.7. That's fine, I suppose. Because this is the part that reuses the lime, if I remember rightly. Gravel comes through. is good and it is catching up as well that's what you want to see well is it though yeah it's kind of catching up whatever accounts for catching up in this world I want to see one more cycle I'm not actually sure it is catching up to be honest I think it's certainly trying to. That's alright. Steel is pretty full anyway, so it's not like it's going to be a problem. Uh, science. Proceeding. Yes. Well done. These were Science Lab 3s, they're all productivity wise 28%. That's good. Can we speed up anything in particular? If we did that, we might make things a bit faster, who knows? Actually, are we having problems with. Uh, the science we it looks like we are interesting okay interesting material sciences are slowing us down now that's kind of unexpected We need more material sciences, I guarantee we can find more of those too. Look at them all coming in. Hell yes. Feed the machine. Be 
Hopefully science is hopefully being made again. Oh, looks like it. I'm seeing doors opening and closing. That's usually a good sign. Science is going up. Love to see it. Uh, let's do this. Kind of a weird thing, but let's do it anyway. I want those to be probably emptied first if we can. We still have our backlog, which is good. I love a backlog. And plenty of physics exist. Still working through about 2,000 space science. Which for 60%, or well, 60,000 required, that's going to burn through a lot of it pretty quickly. I mean, how much space science do we actually... How much science we this has burned through? Burns through about 1,000 science a minute. I don't make 1,000 science a minute. Oh, shit, I got it around the wrong way. I thought that was taking more physics. It takes more space. Yeah, okay, I don't make a thousand science a minute. It does all right, but not a thousand all right. Oh, well. As long as it's still going forwards, that's what matters. Well, okay, physics then. How much physics do we need? Because we need... We've got like approximately, say, 3,000 here. So 3,000 times 5, that's 15,000. We probably have enough physics to do this part, but we, when we get closer to the end, we probably need to start thinking about turning off physics. Which is probably a normal thing to say. I mean, do you not turn off physics? Or do you turn on physics? Ah, oh, shoot. I'm going to blame the autosave on that one. I don't know if that's fair, but I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> uh, and then we're almost out of space science again. Wait, actually, hang on, we've run out of other stuff too. We're running out of material science. Interesting. When's that coming back? How do you run out of material sciences? It's so strange. Oh, the answer is uh, using very, uh, like, inserter twos. Inserter twos will definitely do that. But at the same time, I'm not really seeing any urgency with these. I'm going to change that. We're going to go grab some of these just basic yield modules. The basics. We don't get too clever. Quite frankly, we also need to go to Mechan Assemblers. Basic yield modules. Uh, boxes. Oh, yeah, I mean, beacons. You love to see them. Big fan. Uh, and then speed them up. Power up the beacons, I suppose. Wonder why we're going so slowly. Come on, guys. This is an 
This is an important operation here. You can't just stop because you can't be bothered. Here we go. We don't have enough mineral dust, which is the funniest thing, given the fact that mineral dust is a huge problem elsewhere in the factory. You don't even know how good you got it, do you, Factory? Factory does not know how good it has it. It's doing its best. Okay, are we good now? I think we're good now. The only thing that would make us gooder, if you'll pardon what I just said. Oh shoot, never mind, we're, we're not good, everything's wrong. <laughs> alarm, alarm, alarm. Ah oh, jeez. We got belts work that way. I forgot the simple rule of belts. As if everything that I've gotten. Pain, humiliation, I shall not forget this day. I shall forget this day pretty quickly, actually. Oh, burn, redeem, stretch. Uh, yeah. Alright. Uh, that was actually a good stretch. Thank you very much, Sullivan. I needed that. I guess it's just this fumarole just sitting here. It's been here since the beginning. It's been chilling. We just built over it. I mean, one fumarole, what are we going to do? Oh, I guess there's another one over there. What are we really going to do with them? Nothing. Nothing of value, anyway. Oh, goodness. That's a train one. Okay, what we can do at least... Oops. Is put this in the cargo wagon too. So at least if it's going to take a sweet time, uh, it carries more. Our space science going now. It should be going so good. Probably stopped, honestly. Uh, no, it's actually still going. Meow. Oh, Don the Mask. It's been a while since we've had the Meow Don the Mask from Wes. There you go, the mask has been donned as per your request, Wes. The Wes requests. Um. And we're doing What the Shirt, alright. Uh, well, as we all know, What the Shirt has a theme song, which goes, do 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 What the Shirt. Uh, what the Shirt. <laughs> Today's shirt, I am wearing my Time Variance Authority shirt, all time, always. Uh, you know, I'm really excited for Loki Season 2 coming out. I don't know when it's coming out, but I'm really excited for it. So, whenever that happens, um, I'm keen. <laughs> Keeping the flame going. Yeah. It's an important request to make. We all acknowledge what must be done. Uh, okay. New plans. What we're going to do is we're going to come up here and see if we can grab some more of these great yield threes, of which we have currently one of. <laughs> you know what we haven't done? We haven't put it back to the screen. I put it back to the screen now. I got it. Because of Dave, you slowed down because of those redeems you do. That's fair. You really want to hold on to that top cat, don't you? Alright, so what do we need? We need just some haste, just some regular production module twos. That's no biggie. Those are all over the place. 
Uh, where are they going? They're going up here. That's not what we want. Go down here. Where are our production twos? Turns out Rimworld came out for the PlayStation. It did, yeah. Um, although it came out for the PlayStation, but doesn't have the DLCs. Uh, and it definitely doesn't have the mod support. But, I mean, hey, it's like Crusader Kings on the consoles. You can play it. I don't know if I'd want to, but I mean, if I didn't have the console, if I didn't have a you know, gaming PC, I mean, it would be an absolute, you know, great thing. But I, of course, have a gaming PC. That kind of changes the mood a little bit. Now, I'm always happy that people can play a game that they otherwise wouldn't be able to. You know, I know there's some guy who's just like, oh man, I can't afford a gaming PC. All I've got is like my PlayStation. And it's like, well, good news. You can now play it. And I hope they're happy with it. My hope is that I can build some of these. Get some improvements down the satellites. Satellites is my first goal. After that, I don't know. I haven't figured out what's after that. One, 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 that's... Two, one, okay. Well, this, oh, shoot. Shoot, it's getting worse. Okay. Oh, nightmare situation there. Looking randomly, it does not help. Anyway, with that, we should have enough to improve our satellite production. That is usually the reason things are stopping. Not the ships. The ships are actually doing pretty well. Well, I have a funny feeling we might need more haste modules soon. We can bring those in. Rock fuel. I can probably bring that in too. How is rocket fuel going these days? I thought it was fine before, but let's have a look. It's not doing anything. We've run out of iron oxide. Ah. Oh, I'm sorry. Iron oxide is more important than anything else. <laughs> I love the sharp turn the spider does. <laughs> Like that Akita, like, uh, side thing, you know, where it's it done on, like, everything. Akita slide. I don't know if that's what it's called. That's what I'm going to call it. Alright, crafting speed is slower. We can speed that up, though. That's shouldn't be a problem. is 30. I think these speeds are also 30. That's right. It is still faster and more productive. So as long, long as we're launching these rockets as quickly as we can, I'm happy. Uh, we've got backup satellites on two of them. That's good news. this. Now it's probably not going to do much, but I kind of want to do it anyway. A 
will give me a few extra science. And then later we can turn it on when we're getting a bit closer to the end. That should be fine. more rockets off they go oh almost perfect synchronization not quite actually pretty good and we're like another 805 science packs to p or boxes to pick up good stuff Uh, we look like we're about to run out of fuel here. That's probably bad. So, I mean, we need 120,000 space science. Approximate, well, not quite, because it's 28% less. I mean, okay. So, if we needed 120,000 space science, which we do, which is a pain, 220 space science is how much we need for the last two ticks. Approximately. Admittedly, not all of it is as required, but... So, 120,000 divided by... 1.28... 93,000 is needed, and then we need more after that. So, e. Okay, one more thing. 93,500, I think it was, divided by... Each launch is 250 science packs. So it's 374 launches just to get this la this signal last science. That's why it's taking so long. Admittedly, we are launching pretty quickly right now, but still. And then we still need to do one more after that. That's kind of nice. I mean, sure, we could cheat to get it done, but I've cheated too much, so we're not cheating. We're going to see this through. Is it exciting streaming? Uh, I don't know, but we're doing it anyway. Is there any way we could further improve this? That's the question. Could build another rocket silo. <laughs> could. I mean, because the really at this point, the part of the thing that takes the longest is the verb, 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 launching rocket. <sighs> Closing door. Mm. That's the thing that takes the time. And that you can't speed up in any way. But so long as it's going, I mean, I'm not really complaining. It is working after all. Uh, how are we going with sciences? Everything's going through? No, not everything's going through. We don't have any material sciences. What? How do we have no material sciences? Oh god. It wasn't programmed to go and... Oh goodness, what is going on here? Well look, it doesn't matter, we still need the space science regardless. Material science has stopped. Is material science the first science pack? I feel like it is. That's not great. That's not great news. Sorry, I know this is not worth checking right now. I'm just curious. Yeah, material science is the literal first thing that you do. And we've run out of it. We're not making enough of it. That's funny.
Okay, why do we not have enough of it is the real question. What are we missing? We are missing crushed limestone. Can we make crushed limestone like over here somewhere? Yes. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. We've got limestone problems. Sandstone. Sandstone is not limestone. Never make that mistake. <laughs> uh, okay. This is kind of bad. Why is no train here? Why is that not taking... What if I mess this up? Like, is something wrong with this? Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Fine. No, it's not... F what? Oh my goodness gracious. Okay. A while since we had a problem with that train. Uh, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to take this train over to. Yeah, I suppose. Fire a few limestones there just to. Keep it exciting. Spark alive, as they say. Yeah, there's a chassis one in there. I didn't know that. I put it in there hours ago, I'm sure, but I just didn't remember. Just funny. Gonna get there and it's gonna fire its limestoney uh, load. Okay. Look at that. Brilliant. Mm -mm. Love to see it. Then there's more limestone or something that you find over here, isn't there? Oh. Thank you. Next! Need to drop with the mineral uh, sciences. I don't really care.
Okay, the limestone's been dropped off. It's all going through where it needs to go. And we should see things coming through. We should be making mater uh, material scientists again. But alas, I appear to be wrong. Where are my material scientists, please? I see. You think that's more important. It probably was a time where that was true, too. It's like, what if? I think it is actually still true, now that I think about it. What we're going to do is we're going to do this. I'm just going to dump it that way. Here we go. Keep it full. Um, I about to say, should I be worried about the lack of mineral dust, but no, just taking a different route. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Uh, and we've got a delay here because we don't have enough light. <laughs> Rock fuel seems to be the delay. The delay. Okay. Is that iron oxide is the problem? Yes, I believe it is. Um, that might actually be a, <laughs> a bigger problem than I anticipated. Okay, we're good now. So, Iron Oxide Train came back. Uh, how is that going? Not great. Well, let's improve Iron Oxide, I suppose. Oh no! Oh, I thought I dropped a snack, but I did not. It was close, though. So what's happening here? Well, we are putting iron oxide in here. Okay, yes. And then, do we box it again? No, we're just taking... Unboxed iron oxide, okay. That's fine, that's not a crime. Are legally allowed to do that, I suppose. Um, I just wish that you know that we'd be using iron oxide just a bit more efficiently. Not a crime. Where's that going? Down here. Interesting. Hmm. 
Right, because iron oxide is needed for a couple of things in the steel manufacturing process. Hmm. That's fine. We can improve this. In a couple of ways. First off, let's do that. Then let's do that. And then the trick is we're going to make it go the correct direction. And then, oh, look at that. It's actually things happening now. Wow. <laughs> that Owen Wilson. Wow. So they should be able to load up a train a little bit faster. What if? I got more value. Did it this way. That way we're really filling it up. Now I anticipate this is probably going around the way and doing a similar thing. The anticipation does not appear to be a wrong guess. A caustic solution. What? You have this whole thing that just made tons of caustic solution. That was the plan. Looks like that one's just not doing anything right now. A couple of them have not been doing anything for a while, in fact. Interesting. This is one of those great fixes that I had at some point that just broke things. acid in life. Thief doesn't break things. Oh no, I'm worried where this is going to go. He just builds things weird. No, no, that was working. I appreciate your support, but that was working and now it's not, so. That's the very definition of breaking something. Well, it's not the very definition of it, but you know. dropped off more caustic solution. If your first deep dive wasn't too bad, nice. Congratulations. That's a fun. So we've got more caustic solution come through, which is always nice to see. <laughs> we do that, then it connects it, yeah. That way it's all connected, so that way it doesn't call caustic solution constantly. It's always a course of solution. <laughs> oh, celebration rather. First mate was hard because you were low on nitro, but you finished with 300 on you. Yeah, that's true. You've really got to think about with the game how you're dealing with your nitro situation, but once you get there, once your nitro is good, then fine. Um. I feel like that was never designed to do that.
Yeah, I feel like that was never designed properly. We can remove that. Never designed is true. Yeah, it was never designed at all. That's a good point. It was not designed to do that. It was not designed. It's not the point. Uh, okay, so asteroid mining 2 is at 48%. That's good. What is the slowness? Uh, it is space science. Classic. Is it launching? It'll be launching. Sign. Hang on, why is Labs 2's not like absolutely maxed? What's going on with Lab 2's, eh? Hey! Have a bit of a slow period. I think they did. That's okay. Actually, did Lab 2's just get delivered or something? Hmm. I got a few Lab 2's in there. Rocket fuel does seem to be the problem. It is rare. <laughs> okay. We got a problem over there. Problem is, we keep wanting to use the iron oxide for unboxed batteries. Wait, hang on a second. What about for... Yeah. Right. Also for regular batteries, I see. Iron oxide's important. Hmm. How much do we need batteries, though? That's the real question. The answer is quite a lot, usually. Uh, I've just remembered that we never finished that off, so let's do that now. Okay, get them mining again. Love to see it. questioning is batteries. How important are they right now? Wow, well, nothing really needs them. Maybe what we'll do... And you're all sort of full up as well. Well, this is going to bite me in the ass later, but, uh... Boop. should be making my... Or is there something else we're lacking? We're lacking rubber as well. Oh, not again. Again, rocket fuel, or getting rockets launched is the most critical thing. If we're not launching rockets, why are we bothering playing? We need to launch hundreds upon hundreds of rockets. If there were launched hundreds already, it'd be interesting if there was a stat that could tell me how many rockets I've launched. Not launching rockets, get your hand out of your pockets. It's true. What? <laughs> Complete all mission objectives within the first six days of playtime. Oh, stuff that. 
fucked up that achievement. Uh, it's more than six days. Fourteen days, yeah. This is not a very good speedrun. This is the worst speedrun I've ever seen. You didn't get it done under six days. <laughs> I think 360, 375 might be where we finish this. Even long C block. Ah, uh, the first one I did C block took me 500. But I think I had a lot of time of me wandering off and forgetting to pet pause or something. I think the last 100 hours I was just sort of just doing nothing and just watching it tick over rather than build it faster. Okay, we're good now. We're making, making rocket fuel. Making rocket fuel. Lovely. Glad to see it. Um, how is science going? Is we? It's still space science we're lacking, right? Yeah, and that makes sense since it's double requirement day. At the local science mart. That wasn't a chip, that was hair. They got me again. <laughs> so, okay, here's the next question. How much physics do we actually need? Let's ignore everything else right now. 1.28. Divide that by... 5? Divide that by 5. So we need 15,000 boxes of physics. And that's for the last science. Once we have 15,000 boxes of physics, we can turn it all off. But then again, it's more than that because... We've actually got to do the last research as well. Or well, the second to last research. How many boxes of physics do we have? We've got... 3,000, about 5,000 boxes of physics. About 6,000 boxes of physics. That's not bad. We're about halfway there. Again, considering we do still need to do the space science the heck out of this. is happening. Uh, do we have a shortage of explosives? We do, but it's coming in. I guess it's not a shortage. I guess the improvements we made on that was good. Yeah, they just... Uh, I mean, what, do we think about going level twos on all of these. I think we've got level twos on some of them. I think I would rather have more consistent rocket fuel than it just stopping and starting. So let's go get some yield module twos because I think we've got those available somewhere. Thought we did. We do. They're over here. In fact, there's a full train of them over here. Okay. We'll see what we can do to improve things over here. Okay. So then we're going to come over here, we're going to put... Oh, we might as well unbox those yield modules now. I'm not going to miss boxes. 
I'm not going to miss them at all. People might think that I would, but I won't. Not even a little bit. Any bit? Nope. So, uh, productivity I think is more important than speed. You alright, Panda? You alright? Butter and chocolate, yeah. 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 It's a butter and chocolate sandwich. What's wrong with a butter and chocolate sandwich? I knew that would get her. My wife apparently is not a fan of the old butter and chocolate sandwich. Honestly, I'm surprised too. That's alright, I still love her regardless. This might cause a strain on the marriage. Obviously. <laughs> Off the train goes. Probably gonna have less and less trains going soon. Oh wait, we've got 2,300 uh, binds packs there, that's worth going and dropping those off. You know what, let's, let's change the way we do this. I think we've made a... At the time, I think we made a, d a smart decision on s separating the rocket fuel with the satellites, but what if we just had it as one? Don't separate them, you know? Because at the moment, they're fighting, so, like, it only can really create one, but if we just have it so that way, yeah, just create whatever you can. And change that up. I don't know why I created it that way. I feel like I originally created it thinking there was going to be like a surplus of rocket fuel. Um, optimistic, admittedly. So we'll make the correction now. Forty-eight percent. That should hopefully kick up very soon. We apparently have run out of batteries on my spider. Okay. That's all right. Good job, spider. You did well. Okay. I still want it to be done that way. It's going to be a little bit of a round trip, but I'm not really that fussed about what we're doing. Then, this. We'll go into... Yeah, which is the way rocket fuel usually works. And we're going to turn this one off. Just zero. Bring this one up and around and we're gonna basically bring it in straight back to where it came from which is strange uh, but welcome to how i do designs
And then we will just drop all this uh, rocket fuel off. We'll figure it out. Don't worry about it. It's smart. Rocket fuel is smarter than most people give it credit for. And give me that. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Oh, it's worried about it. Hold it not to. Doesn't listen to me. No, it doesn't. This is going to be much better. Yeah. I mean, why don't I just connect it back into there? Uh, I think it's more fun. It's, it's... Don't I? <laughs> why does it need to come back? <laughs> Answer? It doesn't. Wait till it's done. Well, actually, hmm. We prioritize fuel that way. Uh, now we've kind of broken things a little bit. That's that's bad. Normally you wouldn't have to tell someone that's bad, but it is bad. Uh, we're gonna sit here and just get rid of all the rocket fuel. Are we good now? No. We good now? Maybe. Go a little longer, just to make sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's good now. Okay. Okay, we'll put that carbon fiber somewhere else. Take this carbon fiber and stick it. Somewhere safe. I'll be back in just a second, I just want to check something.
I have returned. I hope you did not miss me too much. <laughs> All right, so how are we doing? We are seeing the science being made again. Love to see it. We're going to get a double rocket there. <laughs> it's 100%. So it's going to launch this rocket and it's going to immediately launch another rocket. Love it. That's what I want to see. There's lots of rockets. Is that a... There's an asteroid miner still there. Strange. I mean, we need so many rockets. We're at 55% asteroid mining, though, so that's cool. This might be actually the longest research. You wouldn't think so, because it's not the 100,000, but the fact that it needs double space science, that's the part that hurts. <laughs> it closes and it's like, you know what? Maybe we'll open it, launch a rocket. Damn right. So you should. I just want to see rockets. I want to see so many rockets. That noise is annoying, but at the same time, that noise is progress and freedom. Uh-oh. That one is... Ah, crap. No, we've still broken it, haven't we? We have still broken it. That's all right. Good to notice these things before it becomes a problem. We just clicked everything again. Right, so. That's done. The right side, please. That's done. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Solutions just keep saying oops until it works. It may not be the best solution, but it's my solution. Okay. Okay. I'm pleased. Uh, we're going to need more rocket fuel, though, obviously. don't know why I built rocket fuel so far away, but I did. Uh, what is it lacking? Rubber. Interesting. I guess we're going to go figure out how we can speed up rubber, then, huh? Okay. Let's go figure it out. I think we might be good for satellites for a while though. Building it closer would require planning. Oi! <laughs> That's why for my next factory, planning is not required. It is actually. It's going to be a double process. That's going to be exciting. A double feature of planning. No, I won't have planning. <laughs> the process. Hey man, trust the process. <laughs> commandos rock rock on. I don't know why a bro voice makes me think of the cheat commandos. Rock rock on, buy all our places and toys. Um short on propane. Scary. I thought we had so much propane it wasn't. Oh, you know what? We did use to have so much propane, but then I think changed everything. When the Fire Nation attacked. So all our propane used to come from up. Yeah. But I can't help but notice nothing's blimmin' working right now. It's not a good sign. A part of that could be because we're apparently low power.
Really? Uh, okay. What is that saying? Okay, sure. Because we're low power, does that mean these aren't working? No, they're all kind of working. These shouldn't be going, they are not. Okay. Repeat, these shouldn't be going that often. I don't think they are. Okay, so wait, I think one of our major problems is actually like these aren't going at full speed because we don't have enough power. Which is kind of a strange thing to say, I know, but what we could do is go grab some sterling engines, some power poles, and uh... what is this? What is this madness? That is probably like... Oh. That is... A bunch of power that we just don't have connected. Interesting. Madness. That's right, you discarded a card and then played a thing for... Madness is nullius. I was going to go with a, a magic joke for a card mechanic that hasn't been used for so long. You know, I think Madness This Is Nullius is probably a better joke because uh, it's relevant and not involving magic cards that are like 20 years old. I'm not even sure if anyone even remembers madness these days. Probably not. I mean, someone would, obviously. But generally, no one else. But now I need 200 sterling engines. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Go back. What we were working on, which was connecting these two power lines. 60% asteroid mining. What? I think when we get to 90%, we'll go back to making the Android 2s. Six point three, six point four gigawatts of power. Yeah, that's a big change. Oh, we'll do a few more. I don't have any heat pipes. What do I think I'm going to do out here? Nothing. I'm not going to do anything out of here. Wasting everyone's time. Very good at that. That should be filled up almost immediately. It just makes the whole mind just operate. Spins and whirs. 
And then it doesn't need to go anywhere just right now. But that's okay. The important thing is that it tried. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. hello. Hello, my little pretties. You have some heat pipes for me? You do. Oh, thank you, thank you. The weird call heat pipes your pretties? Well, yeah. Kind of creepy. Well, you know what they say, you are what you eat. Okay, so that's not making rock fuel because we're lacking rubber. That's why we're doing the power thing though, I just remembered. That's why we started on this track. And it looks like these have made like 300, 400,000 products of this. Kind of impressive when you think about it. Okay, power. Okay, we've got plenty of heat pipes, so don't need to be stingy with them. Ready for the duck. It's important to get a, a duck in when you can. Respect that duck. And finally, there. Okay, so we have nine. Okay, so if we put... 90 steel engine twos. Remember when I was going to build steel engine threes and I just got bored because I saw how much work it would be? Again, if I was not so bot adverse, it would probably be way easier. But I don't like logistics bots. I think they're not fun. So it probably would have been way easier to do it if I wasn't so bot adverse. I am incredibly bot adverse. And I refuse to change anything about that. Those bots are boring. That's probably the hot, actual hottest Factorio take I have. I don't know. I don't know if anyone else thinks bots are boring. Like, I have a lot of weird hot takes, but that might be the hottest. Six more. Ah, I lost count. That was too many. Whatever. Don't care. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. There we go. Power, power, power. Now, the only problem is we actually don't have this power yet because we haven't connected to anything. That is going to change right now. We now have still six. That can't be right. I guess, you know, wind turbines do their thing sometimes. The whole thing is I don't want grid batteries to be doing anything. But they don't appear to be at the moment. Five point three. Hmm. You have a hot take? Lava. It's a very hot take. You're quite right, Solburn. You don't get a much hotter take than lava. <laughs> Meat, I see.
All right, so the fuel has come through and that means we're launching more rockets again, but it appears that we don't really have that much fuel. Not enough to launch a few more rockets, I suppose. Fusion reaction plasma. Is that hot? Is that a hot take? I don't know. I don't know how hot the take is for fusion plasma. Hundred thousand. Oh wait, hundred million Kelvin. Okay, that's a, that's a pretty hot take. I suppose you're right on that one. Can't really argue with that. Oh, it's just uh. Oh wait, that wasn't hundred million. It was hundred billion. Oh, that's off by this factor of you know a thousand. It's no big deal. Uh, probably dropped off over there. That's fine, I guess. I mean, it's probably making things that we need. Probably. They are billions. That's a game I've always sort of thought about playing. Or buying, rather. But then I'm like, I look at the price, I'm like, eh, well, I get the value out of that. I've never really bought it. It looks fun. It looks very, like, old school, sort of, RTS slash turtle strategies. And I'm like, yeah, RTS turtle strategy, or RTS exploring. You know, it's like, the first levels of, like, a uh, StarCraft game where, like, you're just building a couple of units and it's not like full base attack it looks like that and i'm like that's kind of fun but i don't know if i can justify the purchase a weird one can't turtle in it i mean at the end you turtle like my understanding is like you don't turtle for the beginning like you just you know that mission in starcraft one where at the end of it all the zerg come in uh, it's like the early on level, where like all the Zerg come in, but if you like go out and hunt them, it's not actually a defense, you just sort of just chill and just, you win. Reminds me a little bit about that. I like that mission, that mission was fun. Waves come every X levels. Yeah, I mean, again, it just reminds me of that, uh, that like, second Terran mission in StarCraft 1. That if you just go out on the offensive, then you win really easily. There are a couple thousand zombies, that's not much. Um, StarCraft is easy. Eh, say that, I could never finish the first mission when I was younger. Not first mission, sorry. First mission? Final mission. Final mission. <laughs> God. Don't revoke my gamer card, guys. Couldn't finish the first mission of StarCraft. That's That would be a very bold claim to make. Love StarCraft, couldn't finish the first mission. I don't know if you could fail the first mission of StarCraft without shooting your own soldiers. Uh, my gamer cred. Actually, a little embarrassed I said that. I know no one actually cares, but you know, I. Whoa, hang on. Why are you dumping? Why are you dumping? Oh, wait, it's dumping the other stuff. It's dumping benzene. Okay. Phew. I was gonna say. 
if we did this? What if we took this down to 900,000? What is this making? That's making methanol, which we really don't need that much of anymore. Dump itch. Those itches. I got 99 problems, but a lich ain't one. In other words, I'm not bothered by liches. I'm kind of bothered by liches, actually. I think about them sometimes, I'm just like, man, I don't want to have to deal with them. Any game says, okay, now it's time to deal with a lich. I'm just like, I don't want to play this game anymore. I just don't want to deal with a lich. Vecna can F off. I've never had to deal with Vecna, but Vecna can F off. Just not keen on dealing with them. I don't know if there's like a, a campaign or module that <laughs> they're in the Lich on Society. They are. They are indeed a Lich on Society. Uh... I don't know where the rubber came, it just went, but I don't think it went where I wanted it to. Can we make rubber in a better way? Because I think that's going to be a problem for a while. Rubber, rubber, rubber. Could make them out of trees. CR1 at Vector. Challenge rating 1? That Vector is not a challenge rating 1. There's no bloody way Vector is challenge rating 1. <laughs> Hello, I'm Vecna. Y you're not Vecna. Oh, Critical Role. Okay, I've never watched Critical Role. I don't really like watching real play games. It's Vecna. Like, year one of learning to be a wizard. Punch him, steal his lunch money! Steal Vecna's lunch money! See it coming. Uh, is it worth... Uh, what's going on here? Oh, yeah, we saw this one coming a mile away, I suppose. Break his stupid glasses. Kill Vecna's lunch money! At least you know why he was angry. <laughs> do you remember... Do you remember this guy? This... <laughs> It's very much be careful who you uh, make fun of in school, that one, isn't it? Do you remember Vecna? Here he is now. He doesn't look hot. No, but he will murder you. D is Vecna. Okay, we've got all this lithium chloride, which I really don't have a plan for. Uh, a lot of work. The things I don't really care a lot about. We still make trees. Who knows? I don't even know where trees are. Yeah, it looks like we still make trees. Is it worth it? Is it worth doing this all this work for rubber? Well, actually, hang on. Here's a thought. Are we making rubber or rubber boxes? We're making rubber boxes. short on this stuff Bill. where is all this stuff going actually that might be a good question to ask 
Oh, where's my spider? <laughs> I like program my spider to go somewhere. I'm like, hang on a second, I'm not my spider. <laughs> you just like go, and you just see the spider run, and you just look and go, I feel like I'm supposed to be in that. And you're like, okay, come back, and it's like out of range. <sighs> Thankfully, the remotes are never out of range in this game. That's a fun idea. Um, oh, why are we still short of propane? We had another way of making propane before, didn't we? I want the fatty acids. Oh no. Okay. We, what have I done? I've done nothing wrong, okay? I've done nothing wrong, and I would appreciate it if you didn't ask me such horrible questions. Uh, okay, well, I found another way to make propane, which is probably good. Uh, what are we doing? Where is the fatty acids going? Fatty acids is going to there, okay. We're gonna stop that for the moment. Then we're going to use the distilleries that we absolutely have in my inventory. Wow, I actually do. <laughs> Legitimately surprised. Um, we're going to turn the fatty acids into propane. Fatty acids pyrolysis. Probably pronounced that wrong, but that's alright. Now, I don't care about ethylene. Not really. Uh, do I care about ethylene? Ethylene can be turned into propane. pronounce it right. Okay. Now that's not happy because it's full of fatty acids. I get it. I get it. I've been there. One will probably suffice on But what do I need? I need trains, I need... Honestly, probably bigger fluid wagons, but that's alright. Uh, and we do have a couple of stations. Yeah. So, locomotive. Because I think if we have more propane that is reliable, it'll be good. And then what I'm going to do is <coughs> set up a tank. <coughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, 
Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Very much train you may leave. Thank you. Thank you for involving me. <laughs> okay. So then might not go particularly well, but we'll give it a go anyway. We're going to have That right in the way of everything. Thank you. Yeah. I'm going to call this Propene Pick 2. enough batteries we're gonna have batteries okay uh actually you know what you know what we're gonna do the unthinkable we are still gonna need batteries though but we'll worry about that in a moment Uh, it's always good to be building things so close, zoomed in so much, so you really can't see a train until just before it rams your skull in. drop we don't actually need right now is surprising as it is interesting the reason we're not making this stuff is because we don't have the propane right we do have propane right now shit you little shit why are you doing this to me Whatever the reason why it's doing it to me, it's done it now. I don't care. Virus of Waz, it says. Uh, we're at 62% asteroid mining. That's progress, I suppose. Is it a lot of progress? No, but it is progress. Uh, are these rockets launching? Nope, because I don't have enough rocket fuel. We have rocket fuel. Yeah, we have some. don't know what our plan is with ethylene. Who are you and what is your plan with my daughter ethylene? Sounds like a, a name. It sounds like Ethel, I suppose. Although Ethel is hardly a name that's used much these days, I suppose. 
Uh, yeah, I don't think we've actually got a plan for ethylene. Right, we'll let it. If we need propene, we've got it sorted. If we need the ethylene, we've got that sorted too. And then we put the fatty acids back in there, should it be required. Which it probably won't be, but it's cool if it is. We can make 12,000 propane per minute. That's not bad. I think more if we did this. Well, not that exactly. That was real chaotic energy happening there. Okay, now it's 24,000 propane per minute is not bad. It does burn away the benzene. I think. Wait, benzene doesn't burn? Ah, oh, crap. Okay, new plan for benzene. Justice for benzene! There will be no justice for Oh, I forgot about the graphite. Um, uh, b -b 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 I did forget about graphite. You know what? We're going to plant graphite. Graphite goes down here, right? out from the left. Oh. <laughs> I have no real reason for saying no. Just I'm not doing it. If I didn't think about this, is how far I get, quite frankly. Spinning, that's a good trick. <laughs> Little did young Alan can know, spinning was not a good trick. Deal with the fact that we're running out of belts in a moment. Don't worry about that. But don't worry about that! Uh, I'm worried about that actually. Now I'm worried about that. Damn it, this is why I said don't worry about it. Now I'm worried. We could have all avoided this worry. must continue. We 
getting any closer to where we want to be? Probably not. <sighs> the worst part of this is I'm not even sure I even need to do this anymore because last time I looked at it, it was all working. Yeah, kind of working sometimes. Wait, why is it not working now? Not enough ammonia. You are such a little piece. Here's a question. Here's a very important question that I had not considered. This train, how fast is it? The wagon two. Yeah, we could we could do better than that. Or, but the other good news is we're at seventy percent right now. And maybe none of this has ever been needed. Nice to finish it. Why do they make unhealthy stuff so tasty? Uh, to trick you. Fall into their elaborate ruse. I never understand people who are like, oh no, this like salad is so tasty. Yeah, I mean, sure, but wouldn't you rather eat not a salad? <laughs> what? I'm right. <laughs> Just boo all around. Okay, we apparently have a, sh a massive oversupply or undersupply of ammonia. Now, where does this ammonia come from? Where does it come from? Where does it go? I don't know. Bloody ammonia. What the hell? Why are you making this difficult? Okay, so ammonia only goes if this is less than 10,000. It should currently be going. It is currently not going. Why not? Okay. You know what's probably not helping? That being copper pipes. And a pump too. There are some awesome salads. I'm sure there are some awesome salads, but aren't there some more awesome non-salads? Also, no offense to salads, but I don't think awesome is ever a word that I've considered using when talking about salads. What is your problem? Oxygen. Oxygen is your problem. What? Oh look, another thing that we never connected up to, wastewater. That's uh... I'm not gonna miss wastewater, I'll tell you that. With absolute certainty, I'm never gonna miss never gonna miss wastewater ever such a pain to have to deal with constantly what was the steam for? You're making steam for something. I 
I don't know why we needed to make so much steam, but I don't think we needed to make so much steam. Keep wasting water. Steam is for steam times. Ah, don't get me started on steam times. <laughs> Love steam tabs. <laughs> ah, Superintendent Chalmers. Welcome. Yeah, see more I made it despite your direct. No, it's, that's actually the first line, isn't it? See? You already got it wrong. Yeah. <laughs> I hope oh, I hope you're prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. No, it was right. First line is, ah, uh, Principal, uh, Superintendent Chalmers. Yes, Seymour, I made it, despite your directions. Hope you're prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. Nyeh. <laughs> I just love that nyeh. He is not prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. I think we probably don't need to make more satellites at this stage. <laughs> You're an odd fellow, but I must say, you steam a good ham. It's so weird though, why would you invite your boss over for an unforgettable luncheon? I don't get it. Like, your boss that you don't even like. It's clear Superintendent Chalmers and Seymour are not friends, so why would you invite him over? <laughs> I've never understood the invite the invite the boss over for dinner thing. Okay, new plan. Americans. That's an American thing, I suppose. Aren't they all American things? Uh, red wires. We have any red wires nearby? Kind of. I mean, maybe a hot take here, but if I was trying to impress my boss, I try to impress them with, you know, my work. <laughs> You know, classic hot take from C for there, but maybe my work is how I do it. I don't know where the red, red wires go. Oh, I can see myself. Yeah, yeah. It appears a bunch of rocket fuel has made its way into the base. Wonderful. The only issue is I kind of wish it didn't just do that. Uh... No. So how I want to do this. I want to do this is this way. Read, hold, enable, Anything greater than this. See if this works. I generally do not want to be making a lot more satellites right now. Admittedly, I could just be creating the exact same problem I was trying to solve before, but that's okay. from 
don't suppose you have anything in your hands. Strange. Should launch a few more rockets, get a few more sciences. There's something nice about just seeing the rockets just show up on the launching pad, take off, and just <sighs> knowing that I'm point three ish. I think 2.5 percent closer to finishing this one technology. <laughs> it's not really that much better, is it? Thankfully, when I come to this probe, it should be relatively easy to make those. And we'll repurpose some of these to be uh, just regular miners, and hopefully we can it that way. I know Asteroid Mining 2 uh, is likely to give me better chances of getting copper, but quite frankly I don't think it matters. Asteroid Mining is expensive. Yeah, it's actually more expensive than the final technology that I need, because it does needs double astronomical. God, I don't know. So it actually needs 120 astronomical data as opposed to probe which only needs a hundred uh, I was as I clicked on that I was like if that says two I'm gonna lose my absolute shit but that is why this is taking so long okay 100k is a lot but 120k is even more and each rocket launches about 250 base science. There's nothing you want to eat. What about the unhealthy foods? You do? They're unhealthy. You should go for those. I heard they're tasty. But good things about them. Not enough. Fair enough. I mean, every three rockets is 750, which is getting us closer and closer to the final goal. Oh, you're just going to stop, are you? How rude. What is that train's job even doing? Dropping off logistics bots? Wow, I used to have to do that manually. rock fuel going probably super great I take a guess it's actually going all right yeah <laughs> all right I want to see this drop off and then I'm gonna call it for the night <coughs> our lab 2 is actually going those were a problem at the start of the stream are they mostly sorted now yeah, I've got other problems now. That's about what I should expect. But physics, 0.5k. Yeah, we might be okay with physics for the moment. We need 17k. Got productivities in labs? I do. We're at 28% product, productivity on the labs. 28. 28. I don't know where they are. Lost my labs. Yeah. Yeah, 28% 28, 28 productivity on the labs. So that's nothing to sniff at. Gotta go through that line. That, that area sucks. What do we know? 
Not having productivity in labs is an absolute rookie mistake. What if you don't sniff at it? What have you done? You've doomed us all! With your reckless sniffing? These things I don't need anymore. It's always good to hold on to that one. Yeah, I want to see how this works. It still makes a few. Probably makes more than I wish it did, but that's okay. Like labs, actually, we do have a problem with labs. Oh, actually, maybe we don't. Now we got a problem with labs. Yes, that's next. Means gold fix. Let's save here. Uh, and we've got a camera. Boop. All right. Well, thank you everyone for watching today. I hope you've enjoyed yourself. Uh, if you're new here and you've enjoyed yourself, please consider following. I'd appreciate it. Um, I stream four nights a week. That's Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, Sunday. With Monday and Saturday being Factorio. Sunday, being Grimworld, where I am playing a cannibal run, uh, and Wednesday, hmm, still not sure on Wednesday, working on it, we'll figure something out. If I can't think of anything, it'll be Grimworld, but we'll see. <laughs> my, my, my variety day of sorts. Uh, yes, Soulburn has posted the social links there, you got youtube.com slash cat. that is where I post the VODs. Um, at the moment we've got Darkest Dungeon going up there, so that's, that's that was a fun run, I enjoyed that one. Um, and you've also got the Discord link where you can find me outside my regular streaming hours. Uh, I'm done for the night, all I can really say. So uh, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care, everyone.